155,000 jobs were created in November. The private sector, though, 161,000 jobs. Uh, net loss in the government sector of 6,000. Now, that gives the overall net for this down uh, about, uh, was it, 6,000, 155,000 uh, jobs were created. Well, the unemployment rate is 3.7 percent. That remains the same. Net revisions, though, here, uh, revisions for September down by 1,000, revisions for October down by 13,000. So the net loss there is 12,000 in revisions. The U6, 7.6 percent. Long-term unemployment uh, is 20.8 percent of, of employed. Uh, the average hourly wage is up 3.1 percent over the past 12 months. That's a 0.2 percent tick up uh, for last month. Now, labor force participation rate at 62.9 percent. The average hourly work week ticked down 0.1 hours uh, to 34.4 in November. The non-supervisory wages rose 7 cents to 22.95. White unemployment rate at 3.4 percent. Black unemployment rate at 5.9 percent. That matches the record low, uh, which was back in May of 2018, which matched the all-time record low for black unemployment. Hispanic unemployment, 4.5 percent. Asian unemployment, 2.7 percent. Now, health care gained 32,000 jobs. Manufacturing, uh, 27,000 jobs up. Over the past 12 months, manufacturing added 288,000 jobs. Mining lost 2,000. Retail up 18,000. It's interesting, general merchandise stores were up 39,000, but the losses or those gains were offset by losses uh, in the clothing stores at 14,000. Electronic appliance stores down 11,000. Sporting goods stores uh, down 11,000 also. So again, 155,000 jobs created. The unemployment rate remains at 3.7%. Back to you, Maria. All right, Edward, thank you so much.